approaching the 11 o'clock hour, going to be going for about another 10, 15 minutes or so maximum. So not much OT tonight, but we'll be back on Wednesday. Already have a nice juicy lineup going for Wednesday. So tune in 8 uh, o'clock Central Time for the stream on Wednesday. Rick and I will be here for that one here. I'm sure we're going to be talking about the snow, talking about... Uh, yeah. A lonely, cold couple of days, maybe a lucky couple of days here if you play your cards right on Valentine's Day, if you know what I'm saying, Rick. <laughs> Get a little sum sum one time here, but lady alert here for Scotland. Just when you talk about good things about the ladies, here they come. Two black ones here in Scotland's hand from the spades and the clubbies. Yeah, when you marry 30 years. Uh, that's not right. Let's not go there. That's a long time. No, seriously. Uh, Ace, King, three. I'll give you a a bonus here. The yeah, ace, kill a K. Might need to go earmuffs for any kids that are still uh, awake. Oh, it's past 1030 there. I might need a barf bag depending on how this story goes. No, it's it's something I read in the news. It'd be, you know, I just mentioned uh, my, me and my wife are going to be celebrating 30 years. Married? How long have your parents been married? Longer than that. All right. Well, let's... Uh, 38 years, I believe. Stevie's still years. in the chat. He can... Uh, they just celebrated that. anniversary. I think it was 38, if I'm, if I'm correct. We'll wait till this hands over. I'll tell you what I read. An eight. Uh-oh. Kill a K once again. Wow. Gets there from behind. Gets it. Now John is dead to three outs. Out of 500 here. Kill a K in position. I think Kill a K is just going to smooth call this bet. I don't think he's going to end up raising this one right now. Let's see. Played with Killa a lot, taking his time here. And it looks to be, I think he maybe will be raising, actually, so I might be mistaken. I thought he was just going to smooth call this one and make a move on the river, depending on what brings. Let's see. And there you go. He's calling out those calling chips. See, all that's left for him are the three tens. Let's see. What did he do there? So he just flatted it, right? He did just flat it, yeah. it looks like here. So now, let's see, I'm not quite sure what's going on. Kevin talking to Kay here, having a discussion. I don't see the all-in placker. He might have announced raise. Let's see. We're still looking. Kevin's looking, talking to Joe here. We got look at shout out to Joe's dome here, right in front of our camera. Good thing he's four foot two, and he's not hitting our cameras. Just kidding, Joe. You know, if you're four foot two, I'm four foot one. So it looks so, like yeah, it might have been a little bit stringy. He might have announced raise, so it just goes to a minimum raise there. So pretty interesting, but nonetheless, gets snapped off by John. So we're going to move on to a river, 1.3 in the pot, stack the pot ratio. Pretty good here for K to fire in a uh, doesn't come a river jam. So after that action and kind of strainness on the on the turn, I imagine there John would check that river. And now K going for five, a quick five or 450. 450. And that bet was pretty quick. And again, we can't. Rick and I can't hear the table from the booth, so I'm not quite sure exactly what happened there on the turn. If K announced raise, did he not? So who knows? But still a little bit strange. But he has the best hand here, aces up. And John now put in a tough spot here with just ace with a 10 kicker. Really only beating spades. You know, losing to ace nine. But well, he's beating ace nine. Yeah, he's K, beating K wouldn't be ace yeah. jack, ace queen. Yeah. Losing to a, a lot of hands is what I was meaning to say here. And John makes the call though, so so Killer would get paid off there 450. Yeah. And John's a little disappointed in himself there, and K wins a uh, a nice one there.